This is the endangered Huachuca water umble. It's a very unassuming little plant, which is kind of ironic considering all the trouble that it's caused. This is an aquatic plant that only grows in permanently saturated soils along watercourses and cienegas and springs in the desert southwest in southern Arizona. This is the tiny flower of the Huachuca water umble. Those buds are about the size of a poppy seed and the flower itself is, I don't know, an eighth of an inch across. You would never even notice this plant if you weren't looking for it. And this plant has caused 20 years of litigation between the Center for Biological Diversity and various other parties that would wish to destroy this river for whatever gain they seek. This plant is a very good indicator of the health of a riparian area. If this plant can't survive, it probably means that your riparian area is dying, which of course has been the fate of about 90% of our riparian areas in the desert southwest. This plant only grows in a couple dozen places in Arizona. And some of those places have already been wiped out. The populations have been wiped out. But here on the San Pedro, the biggest threat is groundwater pumping. And that's driven by population growth in Sierra Vista, which is driven by Fort Huachuca. Major military installation there. And that's been the source of our litigation. We petitioned to protect this plant on the Endangered Species Act in 1993 and have been working ever since to make sure that this river does not dry up and this plant does not disappear along with it. So the primary way that this plant reproduces itself is these little tendrils will break off in a flood and float downstream and just recolonize another muddy bank somewhere further down. It does have flowers, it has tiny little flowers but uh, it's not clear how those are pollinated or how it reproduces sexually. So a clump of it will catch up here on a little muddy bank like this and then it'll send out rhizomes and it'll colonize this little area right here and spread. Um, it's not unlike grass but it's not a grass. It's an aquatic plant and the Huachuca water umble could live here for a year or two until it's completely displaced by another flood and it might just disappear from this spot altogether and show up someplace downstream. The Endangered Species Act with critical habitat and a recovery plan uh, and the best available science is really the best tool that we have to ensure that species like the Huachuca water umble don't disappear altogether and uh, extinction is a tragedy but it's the, the, the triumph is when people come together and use the science and use the law and make this happen.